Hey everyone, John Rulin, founder, author of Giftology. And one of the biggest blind spots as leaders that I see being made, especially in 2022, is that oftentimes people are focused on a relationship plan that's external focused. Hey, I wanna take care of clients, or I wanna take care of dealers, or you know, partners, or you know, centers of influence, those kind of people. And they treat those people at a level 10. They get the Ritz-Carlton treatment, you know, they're taking them to dinners and trips and masters, you name it. And oftentimes, the mo one of the most valuable relationships, clients that you have is your internal client, your employee. And here's why. Your employees, make, everybody knows that it makes their business tick. And the challenge is, is that as an employer, as a leader, it costs a lot of money to offer 401k or health insurance, or whatever else. And those are table stakes. Like right now, everybody's leaving to go to another company because they're being recruited and offered 10, 20, 30% more money and benefits packages and all this other stuff. And oftentimes when we're doing our love bombs, our heart bombs, our gifts, we're like, hey, we're gonna send this crazy thing or send this person on this crazy trip and the person back at the office is staying at the Motel 6 or they're getting gifts, but really it's swag. You're, you know, if you give out a jacket, it has a logo on it, that's not a gift. And so my highest recommendation is as you're building out a relationship plan, and you're thinking about clients and centers of influence and partners and vendors and dealers, make sure that you're not leaving your employees off the list. Because if you're treating people externally, they're gonna feel like, man, I'm getting like the redheaded stepchild kind of syndrome. Like I'm getting the scraps. And oftentimes people make decisions on leading, leaving a company based upon how they feel. Do I feel loved? Do I feel respected? Do I feel taken care of? Is, is my spouse included in things? And so taking care of the inner circle, all the things that we teach about building relationships externally, if you don't take the time to focus internally on your most important relationships, your internal customer, your, your employee, oftentimes those people are gonna leave based upon how they feel. And so I'd highly encourage you as you're building out your list, include your employees, think about are they married, do they have a significant other, do they have pets, do they have kids? The answer probably to a lot of those questions is yes. And make sure that you're building out a program, a plan, to invest in those relationships at the same level as you're investing in your external relationships.